Hello friends and welcome to a new episode of Pack Hunting Diecast in Europe. We're here at the Euroshop in St. Niklaas in Belgium. And as you can see this is the CQ section. But first I wanted to show you this. It looks really nice and clean. A big thumbs up for the Euroshop in St. Niklaas. Well done. So after the holidays. Let's start over here. We have this nice blue Mercedes from Siku. The welcome to the zoo truck. One of my favorites. Uh, rockets from Elon Musk. And look at this truck. Looks very nice. This helicopter looks also very cool. It's a little bit bigger. You have also some smaller helicopters from CQ, but this big one looks very nice. And look at this combination. The Jeep in combination with the boat. Very nice. Ooh, this is also one of my favorites. Another welcome to the zoo truck. Another helicopter. Here we got some five packs here and there in the above in the left you see a small helicopter but that one is not as good looking as the the bigger one. So if you wanted to buy a helicopter from CQ buy the bigger one. That one is looking way better. Here we got a five pack with some racing cars. See this is also a truck but with the small helicopter unfortunately but I remember from my childhood that they also have uh, trucks with bigger helicopters maybe they do that again in the future the money to hey taxi I like that taxi yes we got the Porsche spider yeah that looks very nice not bad and here we got a red beetle and on the left side you can see it already a little bit it also comes with stickers you see that so uh, you can place the stickers on the car a nice tractor so we go over here we got an Alfa Romeo oh this one is really fun in real life and it comes with a driver, which is pretty cool, I think. The BMW. We got the Audi Q5. This one is very nice. With the wing doors. My favorite. The SRT Hellcat. This one is looking very good. A lovely casting of CQ. Let's put it back over here. Another one with wing doors. Ooh, this one is also looking good. The class. Another Mani 2 in the back. And this one is looking also very good. Another tractor. I get a lot of uh, positive reaction on uh, CQ. So in the future. I will definitely do some more CQ and some unboxing. This Bentley looks very nice. Lovely yellow color. Okay, let's go. Ah, here we see the prices. So on the package you see a color, orange, blue. You see on the left and the above you see the color and uh, then you can look on that sign and you can see the prices <laughs> the Jeep this one is also looking very good really nice wheels um, you can compare CQ with uh, green light or outer world or Johnny lightning this is actually uh, like Hot Wheels made for kids so it has to be a combination between detail and uh, it has to be strong enough so kids can play with it but 
but the main reason that CQ is more expensive, for example, uh, Hot Wheels or Matchbox, the steel is of really good quality. See, we have a lot of CQ over here, which is really nice. Okay, let's see what we got here. We got the Mini, we got the Gumpert, there's also a green one, and then it comes with the Cayenne Porsche. Ah, I like this crane, this baby crane. CQ is really good with cranes, but uh, then you have to buy the bigger skills. A Lambo, looking good. And these cars are also really heavy because of the thickness of the steel. I like this school bus. I'm going to do an unboxing of this school bus in the future. Panda van, another bus. Motorcycle. See, this one is also coming with stickers. KTM. Really nice motorbike. Forklifter. Another tractor. Another taxi van. VW. And this one is also really cool with the uh, traffic signs. I like that. The Jeep again. Audi R8. And this is also pretty funny. The lawn mower. mower. Oof, I don't know how to say it. Lawn tractor. That's better. Yes. This is also really nice. The BMW. 6.45 Got another tractor The Porsche GT The Dea Elfin is also looking very good Ah, kijk, this trailer is also, let's make a combination with that and uh, you can see how it looks See, it looks pretty good I like this combination this tractor and trailer have very good uh, detail. BMW motorbike. This one is also looking very nice. Water plane. Another van. So let's go over here. Got a fire truck. Another one. VW. Here we have the small helicopter. Ah, let's compare it with the bigger one. See, the bigger one is looking way better. But also different price. Yeah, that red helicopter looks very good. A Eurofighter. Definitely going to need that one for World War Three. Another tractor. And on the left side we got the Leopard 2. We also gonna need that one for World War 3. Which is coming soon. Now with Iran. Uh, here we got some uh, road signs. And this cement. Ooh, I like the space shuttle of CQ. It looks really good. There it goes. Okay, let's go to the bigger scales. Ah, here we have the Gumpert. The green Gumpert in combination with the Cayenne pores. This is a cool combination. Really nice. So let's take a look at the package. Because CQ always have some picture of what is capable. Take a look at the back. Yeah, this is 
This is so awesome. Maisto has also uh, uh, this kind of combination. Ooh, I really like this dumper. And in this store, I found I found another dumper. Yes, you go, dude. Let's go to the other dumper. There it is. There it is. And this is also a really nice brand. Uh, they have also RCs here. Look at this bulldozer. This is looking really nice. 150 scale. Uh, let's see. Yes, RC. And this is also RC. This is really looking good. Yeah, this one is also very nice, but I prefer the one from Siku. And this is a 187 scale. You also have a 150 scale of this dumper from Siku, but uh, 187 is the best. Yeah, there are no windows in there. And the CQ1 has windows. Okay, let's see what we got here. We got the liquid power CQ. Oh, we haven't seen what is on the back of the package. Yeah, this one is also looking very good. You can take the container of the truck. Here we got another truck. Ah, uh, this this is such a beautiful scale. 187 Got a fire truck. This one is also looking good with a crane. But I believe there is nothing in there. No, no. Oh, well, maybe there is something in there, but can't see it in the truck. No, I don't think there is anything in there. It's just the truck. You've got the trailer, it comes with two horses, but this is a 150 scale. The car with the caravan in combination with some uh, accessories and figures. It's always nice when it comes with uh, figures. Here we got the big money too, with some pellets. Let's see, let's take the smaller money to and compare it. Wow, the big one is very cool. Okay, let's put that back where it belongs. Yes. Yeah, the cranes of Siku are amazing. Look, that is really nice. Do you have a couple of those cranes in the uh, assortment of Siku? I have shown you uh, another crane was a couple of back hunting videos ago and I believe it was a red crane I'm not sure and it was also a 150 skill uh, I really like this Mercedes fire engine really nice piece You can see of what is capable of. Yeah, this one is looking very nice. I think this is one of the best uh, fire trucks from Siku. And the truck with the boat. 
This is a beautiful piece. Every time I see this truck with the boat, I'm like, whoa. This thing is crazy. Look at this. You can take uh, the roof of the boat. You can take the top of the boat. It comes with figures. This thing is really cool. Not sure if it's floating. I'm not sure. Really cool. Okay, let's put it back. And let's go over here. Yeah, this one is also really nice and heavy. This is a beautiful piece and it comes with two cars, as you can see. Very nice. 45 euro. This one is also amazing. Look at this combination. Wow. Very nice. Let's compare it with the other one. I think you can have more fun with the yellow one because you can slide that out and uh, here this is what it is but that it comes with a, a truck yeah that's awesome totally awesome they're both a must-have okay let's go over here and see what we got more, yeah, it looks really clean. Okay, we got some Fast and Furious, but it is the only one after the holidays. I understand why this one is the only one left. Because it's not that popular. Here we got some Jet Fighter, but it is ugly as hell. Look at that wheels. Why? From above it looks very good actually. This one is also looking ah, quite good but then you see the wheels and you're like meh. Nope. Nope. So here we got some cars from Motormax. Not bad. Not bad. I have seen better, but uh, what is the price? It's it's about three euro, so that's not much. Is it three euro? Yes, it is. We got the Alpha. Yeah, this brand. It's not bad, but like I said, I have seen better. Lambo is looking good. See, three euro twenty-five. Good price. Good price for what you get. This is a pullback car for fifty cent. Can leave that behind for 50 cents. Okay, this is also not that good. 132 scale. Almost 4 euro. Don't waste your money on this. Okay, let's go over here. We got some pullback cars. And these are actually looking pretty good. Look at the detail. You can open the door. These aren't that bad. Let's see if it rides. Yes, it's a pullback car. There it goes. But 
it won't work because of the card. Okay, let's put that back. Okay, let's try another one. No, 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 no. Yeah, this one is looking very nice. Nice detail. Opening doors, like I said. Okay, what we got here. And you can see it's from the brand uh, Nex. Okay, this is no pullback car. Uh, let's see what we got more. Funny car, we got another one over here, 3 euro 95. Nothing on the back. We got a Welly Nex Mini. And a Volkswagen Beetle. Welly Nex always has uh, good cars. They're looking pretty good and for 4 euro 50 that isn't bad. This one is looking also very nice. The Golf GTI one. Very nice. No pullback car. If you're into these cars, opening doors. Yes. It was a little bit difficult to open, so. Look at this. Nice details. Also from Nex, Welly Nex. We got some beetles over here. Not that bad. Rubber tires. Shout out to all the hippies. Some more beetles over here. And we got this beautiful VW van. It's also no pullback car with opening doors. So this is really, uh, I like this one, I like this one, it's not bad, almost 10 euro. Ah, here we have some Hot Wheels street packs. I love this green lotus, this one is looking really good. Three nice cars in a pack. I think Hot Wheels finally starting to learn that it is important to put good cars in a pack, in a multi-pack. This one is also perfect. Three good cars. Here we got another green Lotus. This one is also looking very nice. Uh, especially the Civic which is also really good on track and I believe it comes in the 2020 D case another good tree pack here again the Green Lotus I love that car hey what do we got here the 2020 D case black Bugatti and the green mini this is also a very nice tree pack Another one, now I have to see if there are more black Bugattis. Let's check it out. Put some light on. Okay, these aren't that good. No Hot Wheels, no. They don't sell. Two good cars. Mm, this is also a very good uh, tree pack. Two good cars. Only one. Let's see. No black Bugatti in the back. Let's check it out over here. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Nah, 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 nah. Don't like that one. 
No. No, no, no. There's so there's only one black Bugatti in the Euro shop in St. Nicholas. And some other very good three packs. Yeah, this one is really good on track. No, 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 no. So let's put the other ones back. Yeah, I like that. Wow, this one is nice. And let's put the best three packs in front. Okay. Another one. It's very important when you look through all this stuff that you make sure everything is put back on a proper way. Look at this three multi packs. Very nice. And I put them in front. So that looks very good. Three nice multi packs. Okay, we got some 10 packs over here. Uh, and I see my favorite car already. Look at this. No, not you. Also looking good. But this one. Yes. This is some. Mad Max looking car and every time I forget the name of this car, but it's looking really nice Okay, let's put it back. This one is also a very nice 10 pack Some skylines I see a King Cuda nice pores. This is a very good 10 pack I see only one car, one fantasy car, and the rest is all good. It's worth the money. Wow, this one is totally awesome. Okay, we got some more 10 packs. No, this isn't a good 10 pack. No, not that special. I also made a video of a multi-pack from uh, Majoretta and that multi-pack was awesome. But that's also because Majoretta doesn't make any fantasies. Look, really nice 5-pack. The Flames, Nightburners, also very nice. Police Pursuit, uh, not my favorite. Fun Park. I like it, I like it, and especially the ice cream van, that one is really nice. I hope to find it in a single pack. Okay, let's see what we got more, maybe an exotic, but most of the time those are the first ones that are gone. No, no, no. Whoa, something is falling down, and if that's the case you put it back make sure when you left everything is nice and clean rock and roll bus I like that one okay let's see no exotic fun fun park track builders good for the track but uh, not my favorite castings. Way too much fantasy. This one is also looking very nice. Got some flames over here. Hot Wheels Metro. Mm. Now another fun park. The exotic is already gone. And I totally understand that. Hey, but what have we got here? This beautiful Matchbox 5-pack. Look at this one. The Rambo Lambo. The Audi R8. 
the purple Bentley and the Volvo. This is very nice. The Autobahn Express. I really like that Mercedes casting. And of course the Rambo Lambo. Those are my two favorites. Let's see what we got more. Yeah, the Subaru is pretty nice. Ooh, this is also a very nice pack. The van, uh, the Golf and the Rally truck are my favorite by far. I really like this super fast van. This one is also very nice. One of my favorite pack of Matchbox. We put the good ones in front. They have a lot of the same uh, five packs over here. And I think that is a problem from a Matchbox. They're sending a box with a lot of the same five packs. Then I think why not uh, more different five packs. Now you have so much the same and they won't sell. I'll bet if I come back after a year they're, they're, those five packs are still there. And then the store uh, doesn't restock. Yeah, these monster trucks, it's not my thing, but I understand when you're a kid that you like these things. And uh, what I do like about these monster trucks is uh, the painting. I think that looks very good. Yeah, look at this one, it looks really nice. Whoa, scary. We got a Bigfoot over here. But if you really want a nice Bigfoot, you have to buy the one from Greenlight. So let's put it back where it belongs. Got some more monsters. Look at that painting, that is really nice. Another Dutch. Let's see if we got some more over here. Whoa! Falling on the ground. The skeleton. Okay, I was hoping to find the Star Wars The Falcon Millennium. <laughs> but of course that one was already gone. Uh, I hope to find it in the future. We'll see. Okay, you see some packaging some packages are falling down. Just put it back where it belongs. That is really important. Okay, we got some color shifters over here. Not that special. Oh. Uh, put it back. No, I don't like the Mario cards. Cards, the Toy Story. We got some Disney figures. The only reason I I buy this is because of the cards. I like the cards. But the cards inside no. No, no, definitely not my thing. Minnie Mouse. We got Pete, we got Goofy. Here we got some Halos. If you're a fan of Halo, then maybe this is uh, your thing, but it isn't mine. Oh, this was really looking good. I really like the art on the cards. So, I bought this, but I bought this not for the cars, yes, also for the cars, but more for the artwork on the cars. I love this artwork. This was also a really nice car. So, I was really glad uh, finding this. Look at this. 
very nice. I've got four of them. Yes, this was also beautiful. All hustle, no disco. So I got these four. The rest was double. So I was really glad. And the one on the left is my favorite. Beautiful artwork. So let's see what we got more. We got some Zamax over here of Zamac. Let's see if I can find the one with the red rims. My favorite. Let's see. I really like uh, Zamax. Yes, there it is. The one with the red rims. My favorite. My favorite Zamax of this set. Let's put this one in front. Get some more. It's important. You go all the way to the back. So you are sure you don't miss anything. I also bought this one. Every time I see this car I think wow it's awesome. The Camino. So let's see if we can find the chase piece. But I believe that one is already gone. But we have to check it to be sure. Let's see all the way to the back. No. No toilet truck. So here we are, mainline Hot Wheels, and we got some 2020 CKs, but unfortunately not the DKs. Some really nice castings, but I'm gonna use this part of the video to tell you what's coming. Because in February I have some pretty cool events where I'm going to. Um, 1 February I'm going to a smaller event of diecast cars, it's uh, in my neighborhood. Uh, 15 February I'm going to the biggest diecast car collectors event in Europe. 16 February I'm going to a very big event with not only uh, diecast cars but also RC, model trains, boats etc. So that's going to be awesome too. Uh, now you all know sometimes I flirt with RC. I also like RC and I think many of you have the same thing. So this of course is a diecast channel and stays a diecast channel. But I think it's pretty nice if I do a video about that big event. Uh, I also have some uh, mail call where I'm going to do a video about... Um, yeah, I want to do some unboxing from CQ Cars, so that's what's coming. Um, of course, I'm hunting uh, for the 2020 DKs. I'm going to visit a beautiful diecast car store in the Netherlands. You won't believe what you see, it's going to be amazing. Um, it's like the store where I was in uh, Belgium Antwerpen, one of my last pack hunting videos uh, you can see. But this store only has diecast cars. So uh, yeah, that's what's coming in the future and I hope you guys uh, will enjoy it. You know, I always I always read the comments, uh, so if you have some ideas or you want something uh, to see in particular, let me know. 
and uh, then I'm going to do it or I'll keep it in the back of my mind for later so yeah we're at the end of this video and thank you for watching don't forget to like and subscribe uh, yeah I feel a little bit sorry for the <laughs> for the voiceover I'm doing now because I really like uh, the sound of the store and the ritzling of uh, the packaging and the blisters and the cars but yeah copyright was uh, knocking on the door so I had no other choice to do it like this hey tracks we already have that It's also uh, impossible to go to the staff of the store and say, hey, put the music out because I have to make a video. Hey, the hamster track. They're not going to do that. So, yes, it's, it is what it is. A voiceover. Ah, we got some cheap diecast over here. And I'm a little bit worried about the cheap diecast because I see it more and more. Euroshop, if you're listening to this, don't uh, do not do many of this cheap diecast in the store. Good quality diecast is the key to success. So like I said, I hope you uh, enjoyed this video. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye guys. See you later.